Hello. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Sarah. Roberto. Hello, good evening. How are you? Oh, perhaps he cannot hear me. Joel, Joel Trigueros. Hello, good evening, mister. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm just fine. Great. Very good. Very good. I'm fine. Too. That's excellent. Just let me check on something. Let's see. Let me just text everybody to connect. Okay, let's see. Carol, hello, Carol. I cannot hear you. Activate your microphone, Carol. Hi. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Hi, fine. Great, excellent. Hi. Tell me, Carol, where do you live? I live in Soyapango. Soyapango, nice. Is it raining right now? Yes, it's raining. So is it fresh or it's hot? Uh, so, so. <laughs> so, so. Yeah, well, yeah, you are, yes. you got a sleeveless blouse. Yes. <laughs> you have a sleeveless blouse. Tiene una blusa sin manga, sleeveless. Yes. Uh -huh. well, you are relaxed at home. That's good. Yes. Okay, yes. let's see. <laughs> Joel Trigueros. Hello, Joel. Hi, teacher. Tell me, Joel, uh, where do you work? I work in San Salvador. Okay, you work in San Salvador. And the name is the fabric factory is San Nicolo. Creo que así se dice la empresa o me equivoqué. Yeah, factory. Well, the company. You can say the company. Ah, okay. Pero es, es, también se puede decir factory. Yeah. You can say that. Well, and tell me, Joel, where do you live? I live, I live in Via Constitution. Okay. In Nehapa. Oh, Nehapa. Man, that's yes. hot. Yeah. And it's hot. I, you are used I, to it. Yeah, it's, it's, um, como se dice, lloviendo, raining? It is, no. it is raining. It is raining. Yeah. Right now. Yeah, and with the pass of time, you get used to it. With the pass of time, you get used to it. Con el paso del tiempo, se acostumbra. Ah, yeah. <laughs> Así se pronuncia. To yeah. get, say? get used to it. Mm. Okay, let's see. Everybody got the full name. Veo que todos tienen el nombre completo. Thank you. And the ones who can activate the camera, please do. Y los que puedan activar la cámara, háganlo. It's always good for me to see you and for you to see me. So let's see. Hey, es que Robert. Que... Me da pena, teacher, pero no sí, lo teacher. <laughs> Look. Look, uh, I am used to everything, so don't worry. I had a student who used to receive his class in his belt. Yo tenía un alumno que recibía su clase en la cama. Because that was, he was comfortable and that's okay. No problem. Siempre y cuando no esté acompañado. Yeah. yeah, that's the only thing. Because I just have one register. That's the idea, because I just have one person registered. Esa es la idea, porque no tengo uno registrado, okay? So let's see. Uh, Urania, hello, Urania. Hi, teacher. Hi, everyone. 
Ay, good evening. Tell me, Urania, where do you work? I work at home. Oh, really? You work from home? Yeah. Okay. What? Which company? No, no. Uh, <laughs> oh, your own business. No, no. Uh -huh. Sí, sí. Okay, uh, great. I'm a I'm student. I'm oh, student. You're a student? In the, in the university. In the university. What do you study at the university? Yeah. Uh, Universidad del Salvador. Okay, and what are you studying? What career? Ah, no sé cómo se dice inglés, contaduría pública. Okay, public accountant or accountancy. Public accountant. Public, okay. public. Public. So you want to become an accountant. That's nice. Accountant. Accountant. Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, very well, very well. So I have uh, Flora. Hello, Flora. Hello. How are you? I am okay. Great. Tell me, where do you live, Flora? Pardon? Where do you live? Donde vive? Uh, I, I live in Soyapango. Soyapango. Ah, it is raining right now, no? Llueve. Yes. Okay, let's hope not as yesterday. Esperemos que no como ayer. Yesterday was terrible for me. Because of the connection. Man, it was terrible. Terrible. Está suave. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, Delmi. Hello, Delmi. Tell me, activate your microphone, please. Hello, how are you, teacher? I am just fine. Tell me, tell me, uh, where do you live? I live in Antiguo Cojatlán. Oh, that's fresh. Yes. That's a fresh place. That's nice. And tell me, where do you work, tell me? I work in Tio El Salvador. Oh, really? Ah, ah, yeah, we're gonna <laughs> talk about yesterday. We have problems with the class. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. So tell me, what do you do for Tigo? What do you, no entiendo muy bien la pregunta. Okay, look, what I'm asking you is, what do you do for the company? What I'm asking is, a qué se dedica en la compañía? ¿Qué es lo que hace en la compañía? What do you do for Tigo? I work um, recruitment. Oh, recruitment. That's part of human resources. Eh, no sé cómo se dice, compras, compras oh, para la buy. compañía. Oh, purchases. Purchases. Okay, that's interesting. Mm -hmm. Very well, very well. Thank you. Miss, <laughs> thanks to you. Miss Youngman. Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you? Hello. Can you hear me? Oh, perhaps you cannot. Let's see. There's Suli. Hello, Suli. Hello, teacher. Okay, Suli. I got a different question for you. Okay. Tell me, Suli. What do you what do you do on weekends? Weekend. Yes. Work and teacher. Oh, really? Yes. So you work Saturdays and Sundays? Yes. When is your free day? What is? When is your day off? Um, how do you say depend? It depends. Mm -hmm. Depends the of my week. Oh, really? And different term. Okay, shift. 
Shift. Shift. Turnos. Shift. Son diferentes turnos. Okay, there are different shifts. Different shifts. Okay, Shift. interesting. And what do you usually do on your free day or on your day off? Yes, um, eh, eh, in the park, in activation. No, on your day off, en su día libre, what and, do you do? Um, I watch TV. <laughs> oh, really? Yes. Oh, you stay home, relax. Oh, 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 cooking. Oh, really? Do you like cooking? No. You don't like cooking? But I um, hear the in quarantena and practice. Yeah. No, pra really. You're practicing. That's great. That's great. So tell me, thank you very much, Suli. Alberto, hello, Alberto. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Tell me, Alberto, what do you do on your day off? Uh, I share with my family. Oh, excellent! I I visit another another family at at Ataco or Huachapan. Uh, oh, really? Look yes. at the, in the chat. I will write a word. In the chat, I have put the word relatives. Relatives. Okay. Yes. When it's the people, they are family, but they are don't live in your house. They are your relatives. Okay. De esa manera decimos familiares. We are referring to the ones who don't live with okay. you. Ataco, beautiful, man. That's I like it there. I, I like to. Yeah. <laughs> I like the weather. Me encanta el clima. Because it's, it's, very, it's, it's very, very interesting. Yeah. And tell me, Alberto, when you stay home, do you cook for your family? Uh, no really. No <laughs> really. I, I, well, I prefer um, uh, pa, 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 collaborate or, or participate uh, when um, with another another family. Other, oh, but, okay. but no cooking. But no cooking. Don't worry, me neither. <laughs> okay, let's see. Thank you very much. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Roberto, tell me, what's your favorite food? Roberto, Roberto Suarez? Mm, teacher, uh, my favorite food is uh, lasagna. Oh, really? You like pasta? Good. Yeah, I like pasta. What about you, Rania? What's your favorite food? Orania, hello, I cannot hear you. Hi, hi. <laughs> okay, tell my me. Favorite, my favorite food is um, comida china. Chinese food? Yeah. Okay, Chinese food, me too. I love it. I love Chinese food. When I go with my family, I buy a big thing like this for me. <laughs> the ones they get for family, for the whole family, like for four or five persons, half is for them, half is for me. Uh, I love are Chinese. Are you a Arturito teacher? I love <laughs> Not really. Just, just with Chinese food and pizza. I love pizza. Pizza, I can eat like eight, nine slices. Uh, a big pizza or a giant pizza for me it's normal <laughs> i like it i enjoy it thank you very much Urania. wendy hello wendy teacher hello teacher yes. good, evening. good evening wendy i'm sorry wendy tell me joel you asked me something you you your name is arturo or douglas douglas <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, I love Yeah, I heard you, I heard you. Okay. Thanks. Wendy, no problem. Wendy, tell me. Okay. Uh, what do you like to cook? Yes, I love cook. 
Okay, what do you like to cook? Cook. Um, Just please, please do not tell me pupusas. No. <laughs> my favorite. My I favorite. Hate pupusas. Me, um, my um, my favorite food is sushi. Sushi. Mm. Yeah. Interesting. Yes. It's nice. Once on a while, I get the tempo I like it. Nah. It's very interesting. And do you cook, Wendy? Yes, I cook in my home. Okay. What's your specialty? What is your specialty? My specialty is Pastas, I don't know. See, pastas, know. yeah, pastas, pastas, okay. pastas. right? Uh, spaghetti, uh, carbonara spaghetti. Oh, delicious. Uh, with um, the other is um, uh, Alfred sauce with uh, shrimps, oh, camarones, nice. <laughs> shrimp, I shrimps. Yeah, you know what I like from Italians? How do they prepare the shrimp? The shrimp, but with orange. Okay. Hay un platillo italiano que es camarones a la naranja, en salsa de, no, yes, en salsa de naranja, delicious. Um, I don't like flavor with um, oh, or, you don't like orange the... and citrus. Oh, I, really? I hate, I hate oh. um, citrus flavor. Okay. I don't know. Citrus. 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 Yeah. yeah, actually I tried that once in uh, the restaurant. The name of the restaurant is uh, El Pomodoro. Oh. Delicious pasta. Delicious pasta. They cook nice. Me encanta como cocina. I recommend it for you. <laughs> if you like pasta, I recommend it. Okay. Yes. Okay, guys. Now, let's see. Vladimir, tell me, Vladimir, what do you do on vacations? Uh, good night, teacher. Uh, repeat question, please. What do you do on vacation? Um, in home, uh, because uh, quarantena is in home. Okay, so no vacations. No vacation. Yeah. Okay. In the I, year. Oh, I understand that. Okay, guys. I am asking you about the activities that you do during the weekend or on your free day or what you do on vacation because we are going to talk about plans tonight. Les pregunto sobre las actividades que hacemos en vacaciones o los días libres o los fines de semana because the topic for today is actually about plans intentions okay el tema que vamos a tratar ahora se refiere a planes o intenciones we are talking today about the future future with be going to we're going to talk about a special type of future vamos a hablar sobre un tipo de futuro okay the future with be going to if you got into the into the platform si ustedes estuvieron en la plataforma you could see that the points uh let's see the lesson 1.2 and 1.5, I guess, 1.6 was be going to. So today we are going to talk a little bit about that. And let me start by showing you something. Déjenme comenzar mostrándoles una, a small presentation I created. Una pequeña presentación que creé para ustedes. Okay, let's see, I got the presentation. Where is it, where is it? It's right here. Oh, he doesn't. Okay, guys. Let me see. Just let me do something. Okay, perfect. Beginner's three, class number two. 
The objective for today is, by the end of this class, you will learn how to ask and answer yes and no questions using be going to. Interesting, no? Okay, let me see. We use be going to. When do we use it? Okay, we use be going to to talk about plans. Para hablar acerca de planes. To talk about intentions. Okay? Para hablar sobre intenciones. And to make predictions on what you see. And this is very interesting. Para hacer predicciones basadas en lo que vemos. No en what you think, no en lo que pensamos. On what we actually see, sino en lo que realmente vemos. But we will talk about that later on. Now, look at this example. I am going to play with my friends. Voy a jugar con mis amigos. I am going to play with my friends. What are you going to do tomorrow? That's another question. What are you going to do tomorrow? When we use this expression, when we say, I'm going to play with my friends, or when we ask, what are you going to do tomorrow? We are talking about plans for the future. Look, I am going to play with my friends. When you say, I'm going to play with my friends, you are not talking about this moment. Cuando dice esta oración, no está hablando de este momento. You are talking about the future. When we say, what are, when we ask, cuando preguntamos, what are you going to do tomorrow? We are asking about the future. Okay? Any question? ¿Alguna pregunta? No questions. No. No no questions. questions. Perfect. Excellent. Thank you. Now, look at this. It is going to rain tonight. It is a prediction based on what you see. Oh, we see that it is cloudy. Vemos que está nublado. Then we say, it is going to rain tonight. Entonces decimos, va a llover esta noche. Because we are seeing, porque podemos verlo, okay? Now, how do we structure the sentence? But before that, before we get to the structure, let's practice a little bit about the main idea. It's very important that we remember what's the main idea. Es importante que captemos la idea, okay? Like, let's see, tell me, tell me, tell me. What are you going to do tomorrow? Uh, I, I work. I am going to work. work. Listen to me. I am going I to work. I am going to work. Perfect. Excellent. Thank you, Delmi. Let's see. Uh, Arturo. Hello, Arturo. Hello, teacher. How are you? Where How are you tonight? Como le Repeat, va? please. How are you tonight? Okay. Good. Okay. Very good. And tell me, Arturo, when is your free day in your job? Uh, Friday. Friday. Okay, tell me, what are you going to do on your day off? I like go, uh, I will rest the weekend. What? Oh, you are going to rest on this weekend? Yes. Okay, nice, excellent. But the question right now is this one, look. What are you going to do what are you going to do this weekend ¿Qué va a ser 
este, este fin de semana. What are you going to do this weekend? Or no plans? No plans. Okay, thank you very much. What about you, Joel? Tell me, what are your plans for this weekend? Uh, weekend? Yes, fin de semana. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I'm going to drive. I going I going to drive in I going to drive in I go um what do you say para for mm -hmm. uh for a watch Japan. Oh to in este caso para mm -hmm. en destino is it to a watch Japan. Yeah uh -huh. oh really mm -hmm. Do you live in Aguachapan yeah. or do you got relatives there? No. For work? I, I work. Okay. I work. Uh, well. in, the, in, the, in the morning, early morning. Oh, early in the morning. Well, interesting. Yeah. Thank you very much. Let's see. Suli. Yes, teacher. Tell me, Suli. When is your day off? ¿Cuándo es su día libre? Uh, it's Sunday. Sunday. Okay, tell me, Sully, what are you going to do on Sunday? Uh, I'm going to, uh, to be my family. Oh, you're going to be with your family. With my family, my family, my daughter. Okay, excellent. That's great. And tell me, are you going to cook for your family? Oh, yeah. Pizza. Oh, nice. Please invite me. I mean. <laughs> okay. For the two. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, just through, through, the, through the screen. Solo a través de la pantalla. Okay, thank you very much, Suli. Okay, teacher. So, as you can see, we use the be going to to talk about plans. Let's continue with the presentation. Okay, the structure. The structure is very simple. You see, we have here, I am gonna, I'm gonna play with my friends. You're gonna dance tomorrow. He's going to marry her. We have first the subject. The subject can be the noun or a pronoun. Okay, then we have the be going to. Be, be is, the, the, the conjugation of be is am, is, or are. I am, you are, he is. That's the way you conjugate the verb be. But it says be going to. So I am going to play with my friends. You are going to dance tomorrow. He is going to marry her. Okay, so we have here, remember, all these, the be going to, it's an auxiliary, and it doesn't change. The only thing that varies is this. Lo único que varía en el be going to es am, are, or is, de acuerdo al sujeto. The rest is the same. So this can be considered an auxiliary. Podemos considerar esto como un auxiliar. And then we have the main verb in the base form. Luego tenemos el verbo principal en su forma base. And then we have the complement. So you see the question. The sentences are... I am going to play with my friends. You are going to dance tomorrow. He's going to marry her. Any questions about the vocabulary? Preguntas con el vocabulary? Yes. Tell me. Que es Mary? Ooh, Mary. Mary. That's yeah. when, when we as men put that. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's a hard cow, teacher. Yeah, that's why. Right, that's why. Right, that's to get married. Okay. Okay. Any question? Thanks. Any other question? I got a pregunta? No. No question, teacher. Okay. Perfect. Excellent. Now, let's continue. Let me see, yo 
first let me do something okay now when we are making questions remember in this case are just affirmative but sometimes we have questions and the questions can be like in this case they can be yes, no question. Are you going to come tomorrow? That's a yes, no question. Esa es una pregunta que se contesta con sí o con no. Remember, they are called yes, no questions. Se conocen como yes, no questions. And the difference is that they start with the verb directly. Comienzan con el verbo cero estar. O con el, la forma simple. Okay, but the difference when we talk about yes, no questions and information question is the information word. La diferencia entre las yes, no question y las information question es que las information questions, they got an information word. Tienen una palabra que nos pide información específica, like what is your name? Where do you live? Okay, what, where, when? Qué, quién, cómo, cuándo, dónde. All those words are called information questions. And with those questions, you need to answer with an explanation. You provide information. Con ese tipo de preguntas, usted da una explicación, da información. Because if somebody comes and asks you, what is your name? You don't say, yes. Si alguien viene y le pregunta, what is your name? You don't say, yes, I am. Okay? You provide information. See? So, when we have yes, no questions, we have long answers and short answers. Cuando tenemos una pregunta de yes, no question, podemos contestarla con una long answer o con una short answer. The short answers are as follows. Las respuestas cortas son como okay. sigue. You get, are you going to come tomorrow? Yes, I am. Or no, I am not. Remember, as you started using R, this is the B going to. You answer with the verb be. Okay? Hacemos la respuesta corta para el verbo cero estar. Are you going to come tomorrow? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Dependiendo de la pregunta. Is she going to practice baseball? Yes, she is. No, she isn't. Is he going to dance tomorrow? Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Is it going to rain tonight? Yes, it is. No, it isn't. As you can see, it's very simple. Okay, any question up to here? ¿Alguna pregunta hasta este punto? No? Okay. No, no question. Perfect. Excellent. Now, it comes the time for us to practice. Viene el momento para que practiquemos. I'm going to show you a series of questions. Le voy a mostrar cuatro preguntas. Okay? Those, then I'm going to divide you in groups of three members. Luego lo divido en grupos de tres. And you are going to ask and answer those questions. And I'm going to be moving from group to group to check it out. Okay? Do you understand the instructions? ¿Entendemos las instrucciones? Yes. Okay. I'm going to show you the questions right now. So if you want, be ready to write them. Okay? okay. And I'm going to pronounce them for you. Y la voy a pronunciar para ustedes. Okay, the practice. The questions are, what are you going to do tomorrow? Where are you going to go for vacations? When are you going to have vacations? Where are you going to sleep tonight? Remember the pronunciation, I repeat. What are you going to do tomorrow? Where are you going to go for vacations? When are you going to have vacations? Where are you going to sleep tonight? 
Any questions about the questions? Alguna consulta con las preguntas? Questions? No questions? Remember, where, donde, when, cuando. Cuando. Okay? Yes. Okay, perfect. Now, I'm going to divide you right now, okay? You are going to have five minutes. Okay. Okay? So, let's see. I'm going to divide you. I'm going to create five groups. And sections are, let me see. Hold on, I'm going to create one more. And I'm going to, to, to just give me a second. Like this. Okay, guys. You already got the invitation. So please join in. Ya tenemos la invitación. Unámonos. Mi tercer módulo. Ah, estuvimos en el anterior. Guys, no Spanish. Ok. Lo que he hecho. the question, make the question. I'll be back. Yo regreso. Okay. Okay. Empiezo y le, le pregunto a usted si gusta su libro. Ok. Eh, a, a Arturo. O, y después Arturo que le pregunte a usted y Ajá. luego a usted a mí. ¿Sí? Ah, ok. Le pregunto a Arturo, pues ok. Sí. Un triángulo. Ok, sí. Ok. Where are, where are you going to do tomorrow, Arturo? I am, I am going to do, I am going to work tomorrow. I'm going to. Ok. Javier, where are you going to, to go for vacation? I don't know. Estamos en cuarentena. You can say, beach. I am not going to have vacation. I'm going not to have vacation. Okay. Okay. Um, Joel, uh -huh. where are you going to have vacation? Mm -hmm. uh, I have next year's. In oh. on July. Until oh, next great. year. <laughs> um, Javier, where are you going to sleep tonight? Uh -huh. uh, I'm going to <laughs> sleep in my bed. Okay. In your bed. <laughs> yeah. Sarah. Okay. Uh, to, I'm going to, uh, I don't know the, 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 the answer, answer the, this, this question. Which question? Uh, ¿Cuál pregunta? ¿Cuándo? Uh -huh. uh, when are you going to have vacation? I go, I'm has... going to December. December. I'm, December. Going, I'm going to have vacations in December. Uh -huh. On December. I, I'm okay. going to have vacation on December. Perfect. Okay. Okay, the last one. Where are you going to sleep tonight? Uh -huh. What is the meaning? The, <laughs> this, 
on these questions. ¿A dónde so, va a dormir esta noche? Okay, <laughs> I, I, I'm going ah. to sleep uh, tonight <laughs> in my house. Okay, good, good. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hello. I'm going to move you, Robert. Hello, ladies. Hello. Entonces, aquí dice no tiene. I don't, I don't have vacation, teacher. Oh, uh, you I live don't. on vacation. You uh -huh. live on vacation. I, I don't. Okay. I don't, I don't work in the, in the company. Okay. So tell mm -hmm. me, Urania, where are you going to sleep tonight? I am going to sleep in my home, okay. in my bedroom. Good, good. Excellent. <laughs> okay, guys, let me see in... 60 seconds, we finish, okay? Okay. Okay. But no, actually, there's a big group over there, so I'll give you two minutes. You can practice. Okay. Faltaba alguna? Steven. Hola? Say it, I think. Where are you? In Tuscania. No, I don't think Yes. Ay, incredible, incre, incre, increíble, increíble, ¿cómo se dice en inglés? Incre, increíble In, que no nos conocemos. Incredible. Incredible. Ok, incredible. tell me, what is, what is incredible? In, in, We are work in Tigo. You both work in Tigo. Yes. Oh, really? Three. Three. Oh, the three of you? Work for the same yes. company. Wow, yes. wow. <laughs> Look, those coincidences. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> okay, in one minute we finish, okay? Okay, okay, okay. Una vez más. One. Yeah, you have time for one more round. Okay. I'm. Vladimir, where, where are you vacation? So, Ana Maria, hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? Uh, good. Tell me, Ana Maria, uh, when are you going to have vacation? Uh, maybe I think I'm going to have vacation on December. Maybe in December? Yes, I'm Ouch. not sure, but Ouch. I hope so. You hope so. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, that's life. That's life. As it toca. And tell me, uh, where are you going to go for vacation? Uh, probably I'm going to the beach. Okay. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> okay, tell me, what is your favorite beach? Uh, Costa del Sol. Oh, really? Nice. Yes. Do you like seafood? Yes. I love fish. Oh, really? Me too. Yes. Me too. I love it. Okay, let's see. Uh, we have here Orania. Tell me, Orania. 
Hello. Hello, Urania. Tell me. Uh, mm, well, you always live on vacation. Uh, uh, ¿Cómo? You are always on vacation. Tell me, Urania, where are ah. you going? Where are you going to sleep tonight? Ah, okay. I'm sleep. I am going to. I am. <laughs> I am going to sleep in my home, in my bedroom. Okay, I'm going to sleep at home in my bedroom. Okay. Okay, let's see, and I got here, Carol, hello, Carol. Hi. Hi, how are you? Fine. Tell me, Carol, when are you going to have vacation? Uh, I going to uh, next year. I'm going to have vacation. I going to I going to have vacation next year. Okay. Yes. Excellent. Now let's see. Let's see who's going to participate now. Uh, Roberto. Hello, Roberto. Hi, teacher. Tell me, Roberto, where are you going to sleep tonight, man? Uh, and he goes like, oh, oh come on, Roberto. <laughs> You're going to get in trouble. I'm, go, uh, <laughs> I'm going to sleep tonight at my home with my great family. And okay. my wife is uh, next, next to me. <laughs> yeah, I can, I can imagine, I can imagine. Due to your answer, I can imagine. Dada la respuesta, me lo puedo imaginar. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, yeah, don't worry, don't worry. I understand that. You understand this. Don't worry. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Roberto. Now, guys, there's something that we must be careful all the time. Hay un detallito que debemos de tener cuidado. Uh, you're answering pretty nice, but there's something that you must actually know Hay algo que debemos realmente saber, and I will show it to you. And it's this, let me see, let me see. Where was it? Oh, right here, right here. Okay, look at this sentence. This sentence says, I am going to play with my friends. Now, when you pronounce, when you speak, you can say, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. gonna. Yes. The going to, you can contract it and say gonna. I'm gonna play with my friends. Mm -hmm. What are you gonna do tomorrow? What are you gonna? What are you gonna do tomorrow? You see? What are you gonna? Gonna is contraction. Tomorrow. Yes, it's contraction. But it's a contraction that we use when we speak. It is gonna rain tonight. It is, it, gonna is rain. Gonna rain. Yeah, it, is it is gonna rain. It is gonna rain. It's only with the speak. Yes. Just when you speak. Oh, we do right. No. To be honest, some people, some people do this. And mostly you're gonna see it on songs. Si usted ve letras de canciones, you're gonna find the word mm -hmm. like this. Look in the chat. Gonna. Gonna. Si usted ve canciones, you are going to see gonna, but it's not correct, not when you are writing. No es correcto cuando estamos hablando. And actually, gonna is kind of uh, informal, okay? It is correct, it is completely accepted. It's correcto, está completamente aceptado. But it's not, I mean, if you are in a formal meeting, si usted en una reunión formal, and you are talking to your boss, y está, imagínese usted haciendo una presentación para su jefe, it is better if you do not use it. Es mejor si no lo usa. Okay? It is better okay. if you say going to instead of saying gonna. Okay? Like the company is going to sounds better than the company is gonna. Okay? Because gonna is mostly like this. We are talking among friends and uh, Ana Maria says, you know what? I'm bored of this class teacher. I'm gonna go sleep right now. Me dice Ana María, mire, ya me aburrí, no era dormir. Ok, she says, I'm bored, I'm gonna go sleep. It's informal, it's accepted. But if you are in a very formal environment, 
It's better if you say, I am going to. Okay? Any questions up to here? Preguntas hasta acá? No questions. Okay, perfect. Perfect. So let's see. Please, Ana Maria. Hi. Okay, who do you work with? ¿Con quién trabajó? Uh, with Carol and Alberto. Okay, tell me about Alberto. Uh, <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> Oh, then, then I think he, ah, he... Ah, ah, ah. you know what? <laughs> ask him, please ask him here. Ah, okay. Uh, Alberto, uh, where where are you going to go to vacations? I'm I'm going to I'm going yes. to. Uh, uh, to the to the mountain or uh, to the beach to the mountain mountain mount, 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 mountain 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 yes okay, okay you're okay. going to the mountain or to the beach okay another question to alberto please ana maria okay and when are you going to have vacation? Uh, I going, I'm going to have vacation on December. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much, both of you. Gracias a ambos. Now, Carol. Hello, Carol. Yes. Tell me, who do you work with? Con quien trabajo? Eh, Ana Maria and Alberto. Okay. Please tell me about Ana Maria. Uh, Ana Maria, I am going to go. Uh, 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 uh. No, 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 no. <laughs> Ana Maria, where is is going to is is going to uh, to. You don't vacation? remember? Oh, no, the question. No, no recuerda. Okay. okay, ask the question. No. Okay. Ana Maria, where are you going to go for vacation? Ana Maria, where are you going to go for vacation? Uh, I'm going to go to the beach. Okay. Oh, nice. Excellent. Thank you very much. Delmi, hello, Delmi. Hello, teacher. Okay, Delmi, tell me about your co workers. Cuénteme acerca de sus, well, colleagues. Acerca de sus colegas. Um, I. Who do you work with? Con quién trabajo? Uh, Roberto y Vladimir. Okay, tell me about uh, Roberto. Where we're going to the vacation? Ah, uh, the question. How was the question? Remember? You don't remember the question? No. Okay, let's see. let's see. The question was, where are you where going to go are you vacation? Going? It's where, where are you going to the vacation? Where oh. are you going to go for vacation? Where are you going to go for the vacation, Roberto? Okay, Roberto, please answer. I'm going to go um, to the beach. Okay. Hey, the same as Ana Maria. Everybody likes the beach. Cool. Everybody to the beach. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to go, everybody together. Nice. <laughs> Thank you. Roberto, please tell me about Vladimir. Ask Vladimir one of the questions. Pregúntale. Okay. Um, Vladimir, uh, he he works in, in Tigo. Okay, he works in Tigo. Perfect. He works in Tigo. Uh, um, no, no sé. Um, uh, Vladimir, uh, what are... 
what are you going to do tomorrow? Uh, I am going to uh, do homework oh. uh, <laughs> in English. In huh? Homework? The formal English. Oh, okay. I was. I was thinking that you were going to do housework. Housework, okay. Or house chores. And for a moment, I pensé que se refería a house chores. I hate doing no, it's house chores. Homework. Homework. Okay. Do you know what is house chores, guys? ¿Conocen qué es house chores? No. Okay. Good teacher. House chores is when you broom, when you clean, when you do the dishes. Oh. Mm. What we in Spanish call. Uh, Oficios. Yes, that, el oficio de la casa. Oficio de la casa. Yeah, that's mm. house chores. Mm. Ahí les escribí la palabrita en el chat. Mm. Okay, perfect, excellent. Flor, Flor Argentina. Hello, Flor. Hello. Hello. Okay, Flor, Hello. you work with you work with. ¿Con quién me trabajó? Uy, Urania. Oh. Urania. Ok, tell me about Urania. Dígame o oh, ask her. O oh, pregúntele. Nina, she doesn't have a vision. Okay, she doesn't she have a She she's going she's going to sleep in your home in no, your bedroom. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. Listen to what you're saying. No. She's not going to sleep in my bedroom. She's going to sleep in <laughs> her bedroom. Her hair. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm gonna be clear. I'm sorry. Perdón que le interrumpa. ¿Qué pasa es esto? Usted me acaba de decir que ella va a dormir en mí. Because you told me she's going to sleep in your. In, in her. Okay, her. exactly. Remember, guys, <laughs> her is su de ella. And sí, sí. remember that his is su de él. Okay? Sí. Okay. We have to be careful because those little details can get you in trouble. Precaution. Yeah, yeah, we must be very, very careful. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Flor. Okay, something else okay. that we must, something else that we must uh, be careful with, it's not something that it's like in the books, but it's something that you will hear if you talk with people in English, perhaps in the street, Sometimes you're going to listen to things like this. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm going to use Spanish for a second. Voy a usar español por un momento. No es algo que lo encontremos normalmente en manuales, en libros, pero algunas personas cuando están hablando en inglés y utilizan el be going to, they use it like this. Imagine that, uh, I'm sorry, Ana María, you are the first in my screen. Perdón, Ana María, pero es la primera en mi pantalla. Imagine that I'm talking to Ana María. And I ask her, hey, Ana Maria, where'd you gonna? Where'd you gonna go for vacations? Where'd you gonna go for vacation? Listen to the question. Where'd you gonna? In that situation, in that question, they don't even say, where are you gonna? They just said, where'd you gonna? Some people in the street, they speak like that. Alguna gente que usted se pueda encontrar en la calle le va a hablar así. Uh, they just say, hey, what you gonna do tomorrow? Like, uh, tell me, tell me, what you gonna do tomorrow in the morning? You see, what you gonna do? The proper question is, what are you gonna do? Mm. But some people, when they are, when they are speaking in a very, very informal way, they get rid of the verb be. Algunas personas cuando están hablando muy informal o very fast, no le vamos a oír que pronuncien el verbo be. They will go like, uh, where you gonna go? What you gonna do? Where you gonna sleep? 
Where you gonna work? Where you gonna stu Where you gonna study? Just like that, they go straight for the pronunciation, straight for the gonna. Se van directo al gonna. Okay. Any questions up to here? Alguna pregunta por acá? Hasta el momento. I'm asking you because I mean uh, the time is almost over. El tiempo casi se nos acabó. It flies. Voló. Mm. Okay, let's make a review. Let's see. And, ah, we are lucky, Ana Maria. I just remember that I just uh, talked to you. Let's see, Sara. Sara, tell me, Sara, when do we use be going to? What ideas do we express with be going to? ¿Qué idea expresamos? ¿Cuándo lo usamos? Do you remember, guys? And you said... And the probably, um, sí, ajá, cuando eh, digo lo que voy a hacer. Okay. Mm -hmm. Remember, we talk it, we use it when we talk about plans. There are plans for the future. For the future. Plans for the future, perfect. What else? Somebody else, alguien más. Aparte de los planes. Uh, pred prediction uh, on what we see. What you see. Okay, perfect. Suli, do you have another one? Plans, predictions, and what else? Activity. Activity. Intentions. Intention. Remember. Activity. We Activity use, intention. We use the be going to when we talk about plans, intention. intentions, or predictions on what you see. The future. Okay, that's future with be going to. And I will go back to Spanish. ¿Por qué les hago esta aclaración? Porque, por ejemplo, si Ana María va conduciendo y de pronto se acuerda que le falta jamón en la casa y ve el supermercado y dice, eh, iré al supermercado. That's not plan. That's not intention. And that's not a prediction. That's a sudden decision. Amen. Esa es una decisión súbita. In that case, we use will, the auxiliary will. En ese momento utilizamos el auxiliar will. She says, oh, I will go to the supermarket. You see, it's different. But imagine that Ana Maria goes and opens her fridge right now. Ana Maria va y abre su refrigerador en este momento. And she sees that there's no ham. Y ve de que no hay ham. Entonces dice, oh, I am going to go to the supermarket tomorrow. Ya es un plan. O ya tiene la intención de hacerlo. ¿Ok? ¿You get the difference? ¿Captamos la diferencia? Yes. Ok. Guys, eh, any other question? ¿En qué pregunta? momento vamos a ocupar el will? I go will? Hold no. on, hold on, hold on. Ay, ay, ay. Another ay, topic, ay. another topic. Ese es otro okay, tema. Okay. Otro tema. Okay. ok, ok. Este es tema, que ¿no? vea que lo entendí. No les, no les quiero, no les quiero confundir, por eso solamente hice una aclaración, ¿ok? No les quiero confundir, ahorita enfoquémonos en este, vamos a trabajar un poquito más de este. But don't worry, we're gonna talk about that later. Vamos a trabajar con ellos. Okay, teacher. Everybody, okay. thank you very much. I hope to see you tomorrow. Thank Espero you. verlos mañana. Remember, at 8 or a little bit before, at 9 or a little bit before 9, ¿ok? Have a good night. Take care. Good night, good night. Good night. Good night teacher. Good night. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Bye. Bye. Bye.